My name's Shari Cherry. I was diagnosed with NVLD disorder at the age of 51. I think that is really a mystery. I mean, I feel like every day I'm uncovering more about what my experience was with it growing up. There were times that I really did feel lonely and wanted girlfriends to play with. I remember I, it wasn't one time, it was a lot of times going outside in my backyard swinging on my swing and singing um, a Sesame Street song that was Somebody Come and Play. Now I'm 53 years old. I am faced with the ramifications of having this learning disability truly still every day. Some of the signs of a nonverbal learning disability, it truly affected my ability to do math, even basic math. I mean, I'm talking about adding and subtracting, especially spelling, penmanship, is also in the realm of like social interaction. I've driven all of my life is a little bit uncommon, I think, for me to drive around and navigate. And I found a lot of joy in baking and cooking. However, following a recipe is really hard for me. There's a lot of words on a page and a lot of steps that I have to take. And I often see myself, you know, repeating the steps, rereading the steps. My learning disability was probably uncaught, unnoticed, was because I actually was a pleaser. In the end, I really wanted to just conform, follow the rules. You know, if I had tested that rule and if it made me feel good, I might have been more adversarial and more of a problem child. I can't believe that I'm actually almost cheering up about it, but it just breaks my heart that I could share some sort of bond with people and they have to suffer. I just don't want people to suffer. And I hope that they um, feel loved like I was. And I want them to know that it does truly get better, that adults have the chance to pick out who they want to be with, to find their groups, to find their people, to live their passions, and that they should Focus on the things that make them happy as a child because those are the things that are going to be gifts to them when they get older.